Properties of circles. In this video, we are going to focus on angle at the center and angle at the circumference. You will find this on page 374 in the Namibia Ordinary Level Mathematics textbook Y equals MX plus C to success. Properties of circles. In geometry, a large number of facts about circles and their relationship to straight lines, angles and polygons can be proven. These facts are called the theorems of the circle. The first one, angle at the center and angle at the circumference. So from point A and B, it's going to the center. From point A and B, it's going to the circumference. So center, circumference, center, which is indicating that one, circumference. So this is the two we're going to compare and this is the two that we're going to compare. So in each figure the arc ACB substance an angle AOB at the center, angle at the center of the circle and an angle APB at the circumference, angle at the circumference of the circle. We will see the relationship between these two angles, AOB and APB, in the following investigation. You can click on this QR and you can look at the investigation. But we are just going to look at the final result. So the investigation reveals the following theorem. The angle at the center of a circle is twice the angle at the circumference. So this, if this angle is x, then this angle at the center will be 2x. So in the diagram O is the center of the circle. Then angle AOB, AOB will be twice, this angle AOB will be twice that angle APB. Okay, uh, let's look at an example. So in the diagram, O is the center of the circle um, and angle COD, C, C, O, D, let's just make this a D, C, O, D is 110. Find angle C, P, D, C, P, D. So in this case, we start with the statement, angle C, O, D, is twice CPD. But if I want to find CPD, I'm just dividing it by 2. So angle CPD will be 55 degrees. Okay, I want you to stop the video and I want you to do try now 19. You can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Okay, let's start. In the diagram, O is the center of the circle and angle EPF E, P, F. So in this case, I gave you the center, and in this case now, I'm giving you the circumference one. Okay, so if I start with that one, I can start exactly the same with the statement, the theorem, okay? So I'm going to start by saying, let's get the pen, um, angle E, P, F. Let's see. E, P, F, that's good, will be 2 E, O, F, E, O, F, okay, now I think it's angle E, O, F, let's start with that one, I just want to correct it, so it's angle E, O, F will be 2 times angle E, P, P, F. So, in this area I want um, E, O, F. So, it will just be 2, and that will be 48. And then the answer will be um, 96 degrees. Okay. Let's look at example 20. In the diagram, O is the center of the circle. And angle G, P, H is 140. Find the reflex angle, GOH. -O so start again, GOH will be 2 times GPH. Then I just substitute it, 
and I get my answers. The obtuse angle GOI is not the angle at the center. So it's just say, this is not the angle. Let's just get the color. This is not the angle at the center. That's incorrect. This is the angle at the center. This is the angle at the circumference. Okay. I want you to stop the video and I want you to do try now 20 number 1. Again, you can continue the video as soon as you are finished. Okay, let's start. In a diagram, O is the center. You can see the picture of the circle. And angle LPM is 150. LPM is 150. Uh, find the reflex angle LOM. So if I'm starting with that one again, just get a pen. Angle LOM. Angle LOM. Angle LOM is 2 times angle LPM. So that will give me 2 times 150. And that will give me 300 degrees. So angle LOM, that reflex, is 300. Okay, let's look at the last one. In the diagram, O is the center of the circle, and angle ABC, ABC is 38, and angle B, B, C, O is 30. Find angle ADC. A, D, C. Okay, now let's first start with the properties. Let's first look at all of them. So angle AOC, angle AOC, that one, is twice a, B, C. That one is twice this one. And then it's 76. And it's good always if you fill it in. 76. Okay. And then angle A, D, C. A, D, C. Is equal to angle. This is the exterior angle. So these are the two interior angles. And this is the exterior angle. So if I add it up, I get 106. And that's what they ask. Angle ABC. ADC. Okay. Again, I want you to stop the video. And I want you to do try now 21. You can continue the video as soon as you are finished. In the diagram, O is the center of the circle. Uh, MP and ON intersects at right angles. Uh, at Q, and this is 24, I find angle MPN, let's just see. MPN is this one. Okay, that we are going to find. Okay, so let's just start first. Um, we will first find, okay, so this is angle, let's just see, angle at the center, angle at the circumference. So JLK, no, this is not this one, it's 21. Okay. So if this is a right angle, I can find first that angle at the center. Can you see? In that triangle. So I'm going to say uh, triangle. I just want to use another color. Triangle M-O-N. Let's see. M-O-N. Yes. Triangle is going to be that 180 minus the 90 minus that 90 minus that 24 and that's going to be 66 degrees okay so if this one is then 66 and actually fill it in there 66 then I'm going to continue so I'm, I'm like actually looking for so angle at the center angle at the circumference so again I can say um, angle let's just say Angle, M-O-N, M-O-N, is two times angle M-P-N, M-P-N. And if I want M-P-N, then I'm just going to divide it by two, by two. So angle M-P-N is going to be, okay, and now I'm just going to write it in. So this is going to be um, this 66. Oh, sorry. 66 divide 2. So therefore, 
angle MP in is equal to 33 degrees. Okay. And that's the final answer.